Music Man back again with another edition of Toy Nuts. I know it's been a while. Haven't been finding a great big bunch of stuff, but I did some uh, flea markets and some thrift shopping this weekend. Found some good scores, so I thought I'd show it all to you. First thing, I went to the flea markets and I picked up, finally found me a bone figure. Flea in the package, got him for a whole $3. I thought that was awesome. Then I bought this little bag of Funko Minis. And the big reason I bought the whole bag was to get Grimm from Billy and Mandy. I guess this is one of the cartoon blind box minis, but that's awesome. Uh, I guess this guy's from Game of Thrones. I've never watched it. And a mini wrestler. I'll send that off. And then one of the Walking Dead. I'll probably keep him. But uh, that's what I found. Flea marketing. And then was really surprised. Went to a thrift shop. Found a great big couple bags. Uh, this had some blind box Doctor Who figures in it was in the bag thought that was pretty cool what really got me to buy the bags was there was a whole bunch of action figures starting off there's a Tron figure from the new movie a three and three quarter I've only got a couple of those uh, air raider is but it's one of the clone troopers he was in there and then the whole reason I bought it now there are a couple well I guess there's only the one there was one vintage GI Joe in there uh, and then I don't know if this is a GI Joe or not There was this dude, and I don't know my my new Joe's so well, so you'll have to forgive me. Uh, these are probably going to be staying in my collection for a while. Uh, some really cool figures. I can't wait to find out who these guys are because it's. Like I said, I'm not up to date on the newer Joes. Uh, newer version of Snake Eyes. Like this dude. Um, there was three dogs. I'm pretty sure that's Snake Eyes dog there. Uh, Rottweiler and then this dude plus well there was also this in the bag little Kubrick alien guy and then a lot of parts and pieces for the Joes I'm pretty confident that I have all the pieces so I can't wait to get through those and get them all put together uh, Somewhere in there, I think there is a newer version of Zartan because I do have a little bag here that has a couple of the uh, masks for him in it. And the masks are actually there. There's one. And there's the other. So I thought that was pretty cool. And then...
Hmm. I don't know where I put it. But I also scored... Uh, I just won't show it. It's most of the playset to a uh, Star Trek bridge, which anybody that knows me real well, I'm not a great big Star Trek fan. I do like the classic version, just not the captain. Never been a James T. Kirk fan. Love Spock, Bones, all of them. But I'll probably end up using that for something else cooler. But also, I found Mint on the card. Now, with me finding Venkman leads me to get Stance and Zedmore. And I will have the complete set of these, which I've been wanting them. <coughs> I paid up 10 bucks for him, but on eBay they're selling from 15 up. So, that was a decent deal. And then, I picked up... Newer version of the low light. Got him for $4.99. Mint on the card. And again, these will be staying in my uh, personal collection. And this, I believe, is the Matt Tracker from the new line. Yep. Mint on card. Which was cool. And then. Third one here. Flash Gambello. From the Rise of Cobra. Uh, those probably just all go up on the wall. And then. There was this little bag. Oops. Excuse me. Which I was very happy to find. Because very big on pins and patches so I'm pretty sure probably most of these are from Funko or whatever but there's Pirates of the Caribbean uh, Piglet uh, Larry Stanyard ha <laughs> Scrooge McDuck uh, Lumiere uh, John Gaither, I mean Peter Pan. One of the ants. Or one of the things from Bugs Life, I guess. I can't remember. Uh, Thanos. Rocket Raccoon, which I thought that was pretty cool. And I know they're all backwards, Gaither. You're going to bitch at me, but I can't help it. I don't know this program yet. Uh, Storm. Of course, Mr. Deadpool. Doctor Strange. And the Punisher. And I think I'm going to find me a jacket, at least for the Marvel ones. I'll probably sell off the uh, Disney ones. Or unless Larry or somebody wants them, you know, just let me know. Anyhow, I thought that was pretty cool. I bought that whole bag for like two ninety nine of all those patches. But anyhow, uh, I know it's been a while since I've done a video, and I apologize. Uh, I apologize immensely. It's just when you're not finding a whole lot, you know, finding two or three things, and I tend to keep stuff like that for collector's dungeon. When we do a live show, I'll show what I found because I'm not finding a whole lot. I am thinking about doing a new style show on YouTube. So hopefully here within the next couple weeks I can get that ball rolling. Let's see what that's going to be about. And I appreciate your feedback on what we do. So anyhow, until next time, you never know what you're going to find, where you're going to find it. Happy collecting.